in this episode. Damn it. Hi, my name is Mike. Welcome to A Little Bit of Everything. We live in an infinite world, so we're going to explore that. Today, we're taking a look at Diet Coke and Mentos. I know, I know it's been done before. But why Diet Coke? There's lots of other soda pops out there. Well, we're going to compare them and find out. Let's go. This is my super scientific device I call the keyboard. The red and white areas are incremented in feet. The black and white areas are incremented in inches. Okay, so we're going to start off with Diet Coke as our base model. We're going to use that as the standard for the rest. Let's see what happens. Okay, so here we go with test number one, Diet Coke and Mentos. That wasn't very impressive. We've all seen the videos on other channels where it goes four or five feet high. What happened here? I don't know. I know that all the soda pops are the same temperature. They were all bought at the same time. They were all bought from the same store. So we're going to compare and find out what happens next. Well, a friend of mine just told me I'm an idiot. One Mentos won't do it in a two liter bottle. So I need to up the game and put in four Mentos. So that's me, the professional idiot, part time. Okay, part time professional idiot with four Mentos in Diet Coke. Here we go. That was a little bit better, um, but I figured out I need a better delivery method because actually only three of the Mentos went in. So what I've done is I've come up with this tube, I'm gonna put the Mentos in there and then dump them all at once. Part-time professional idiot with four Mentos in regular Coke. Here we go. That was much more impressive. Then again, four Mentos did go in. Okay, four Mentos into Diet Pepsi. Damn it. It seems that as a professional idiot, I'm having a hard time getting it in. This is regular Pepsi. Okay, this is kind of the off product I was telling you about. This is called Mountain Dew. I also know it's not available everywhere in the world or everywhere in the United States. We're going to see what happens. It's a, it's a Pepsi product. My hypothesis is the one that's going to give Coke the best run for its money is going to be the 7-Up products. When I was a kid, I remember 7-Up being really, really fizzy. So let's see what happens. Diet 7-Up. That was only three Mentos. And regular 7-Up. Well, there you have it, folks. Wasn't real scientific. Wasn't real definitive, but we did find out there are other alternatives to Diet Coke. Um, if you're stuck with 7-Up, you can use that in a pinch if you want to commit a practical joke on somebody. On this channel, we're going to explore our infinite world. There's lots and lots of things to see that nobody ever looks at. We're going to do that. We're going to do some science-y things. We're going to do some tech things. We're going to go out and do some behind-the-scenes things. We're going to do some interviews with people you might even know. Um, stay tuned. Like and subscribe down below. It's an infinite world. Go out and explore.